so I've finished painting for today. I've been keeping the laundry going um, as I'm painting. So I've done the rest of the skating board just there. I've done the door frame all the way round. I've painted this part of the door and the door. And I carried on around the frame. It's going to need another coat, although it does say one coat because it's been so long since it's been painted. Need to get the uh, radiator spray to freshen up the radiator. Then I have actually done the door frame all the way around um, the door. I've done the skirting board all along here and I've done this bit here so um, yeah I'm quite pleased it's taken me a while because I've done other pieces in between to give me a break from the paint I've had the upstairs windows open right from when um, early on this morning and um, I was going to open the lounge window um, as well um, you know just to make sure we've got plenty of ventilation while it continues and I've just got blanket there I've left that thin one there um, because obviously I wanted to wait till it's dry before I start pulling it out to make sure I don't get any paint on the carpet um, yeah hopefully at some point we will get that replaced as well so like I was saying while I was painting I was keeping um, the washing going um, I did strip both of the beds. I've still got to make them. Um, so, in total, I've done four lots of double bedding. Two lots are brand new. Um, they're supposed to be easy care, so they shouldn't need ironing, but it looks like I might at least have to um, iron the pillowcases, I'll see. So, I've got this um, sort of yoga Pilates set. Got these from Asta. They were reduced anyway online. Then it was 20 25% off. I brought them a while back, so I've only just took them out of the packaging, as you've seen um, earlier on. Um, and I think I purchased them for, I think they were £6 each in the end. So I got that one for our bed and this one for our son's bed. Both of them reversible, so you've got the black and the white and this one is this one and then it's got the striped pink but as I said um, that one's not showing um, so badly the creases as that one so it's two brand new um, sets of bedding double bedding this is the one off of our bed um, that is now all washed and dried and everything um that won't be going back on better so this one this is why i did these two sets um first so they would um sort of get washed dried and aired and then coming through i've got the four flat lot of bedding out which is off our son's bed and this one will not be going back on his bed as say i'm gonna probably put that black and white set on done his pajamas um, hubby's pajamas and mine and leggings that I change into when I'm not going out or if I sleep in them so that's all of that um, so yeah four lots of double bedding um, it keeps clouding up then it comes out sunny earlier on I thought it was going to rain um, I thought it spitted rain but maybe I got it wrong um, but when the sun comes out it's gorgeous um, didn't get the lawn, any of the lawns done actually, front or back, done over the weekend due to Thursday and Friday it was fine, but Sunday um, it rained. Thursday and Friday we were busy, we had our granddaughter stay over, that's why I've been painting now because I had to put a stop to the painting so we, she wasn't sort of living in it for a length of time and made sure it was all dry so it came to a standstill. Um, I'm thinking whether I can bother to actually mow at least the back lawn since it didn't get done at the weekend just to get some fresh air and everything and away from the paint um so yeah so that's it and then I'll make the beds later um whether the guys help me I don't know I'll see how I feel but um I've still got my painting clothes on so I thought I might just get the back lawn mowed I said get a bit of fresh air and uh 
clear my head a little bit and then I may have a bath and then it will be time to get tea on because the guys would then be due to come home at some point during that time or early evening I'll get the beds done as well. So I've put our son's new bedding on, like I said, and I keep saying this, I love these reversible sets that you can have two looks in one. I nearly put the white on, this one, but I thought the black set or side um, doesn't look so creased because I've been on the go all day today. I've still got our bed to do. Um, I don't think I'm get the ironing done. Um, as normally I would have ironed um, some of the bedding. It all depends on how creased it is. This one you can't really tell. Um, it's not too badly at all. But the other set looks a bit creased. So I'll see. I'm going to probably have a bath first. Then I'll probably sort our bed out then. And see whether I can get round to ironing it or not. If not, I'll put the bedding on and maybe just um, sort of iron the pillowcases another time. I have got another one of these um, cushion covers that I got from Poundland, um, so that's something else I've got to sort out. But I'm really pleased um, with the bedding, and I say for £6, it just gives it that little bit of a different sort of um, look to our son's room. Okay, I've put that new bedding on. Well, I've had it a fair few months. The quilt cover itself is not actually that creased, it's mostly um, the pillowcases, um, but because it's getting late and um, I've just had a bath and I'm going to have to get dinner on, that I thought, you know what, I'd leave the iron in and do it some other time. I bought up my furry pink cushion that I haven't used in so long, this is out the end cupboard, because I thought of the sort of pinks in with the quilt, so pink and grey. And then when I um, clean the main bedroom, I may put a few little pink bits out. Because normally I have pink um, pieces anyway, due to the fact I have those sort of things in my cubby. So again, I'm really pleased with the bedding, and as I have with our son, so it just makes it a little bit different and a little bit of a refresh as well for our home. <music> 